welcome to episode eight of the Great Virtual Race Across Tennessee. It is hot and humid. Today is day 77, the last day of week 11, and it's the day I officially finish uh, the 639 miles in GVRAT. Um, 17 mile day today. It is pretty tough today because it's hot and humid, and I pulled a muscle in my foot, and I barely slept last night. So this is a challenging day, but I'm gonna get it done out here on the trails. And then for the last few miles, my running buddies are gonna join me and I'll film a little of that. So I wrote down my statistics for the first, these 11 weeks, I have averaged 8.3 miles. Um, my goal, um, for the next six weeks and four days is to get to as close to a thousand miles as I can. I'd like to hit a thousand. Um, the Great Virtual Race for Tennessee officially ends on August 31st and today is July 16th. So I've got all that time left. Um, yeah, I want to get as close to a thousand as I can. I think it's doable. I think my calculation was I'll have to average 7.85, which is a little less. So that's awesome. Um, this coming week, I'm definitely gonna take a little time. This week has been an 85 mile week and my body's just getting a little tired because I haven't taken much time off for a while. So I'm gonna take a little rest and love it and then get right back at it and see if I can hit that thousand miles. I'll give you some statistics later on how I finished. I believe I finished the top. Well, I will, because um, I just looked this morning, finish in about the top six and a half percent of people. Um, I'd like to get that down significantly. Um, when, you, when you look at the overall mileage at the end, what percentage, because a lot of people don't, you know, once they hit the 639, they cut way back um, once they've hit their goal. But I'm going to keep going because I'd like to really want to hit a thousand in that four month mark. I'm tired and tomorrow I'm not gonna run I'm gonna go fishing and I can't wait <laughs> four and a half miles to go I don't even know how many bugs I've got in my eyes because I can't seem to outrun them because my foot really hurts but looks like I'm gonna make it all right just over a mile to go I want to introduce my very favorite exercise companion this is Olivia, my 12 and a half year old plot hound, who is happy with about a mile, mile and a half a day. It's enough to tire her out. We've been together since she was just a little baby. And my favorite miles are my miles with Olivia. And now at her age, she's still, uh, <laughs> she can still pull me down the road. Um, she mostly walks, but we do do a little bit of running. Not, not this evening. My legs are a little sore. A lot of the time, first thing in the morning, we're out at about 6 a.m. A lot of days. Well, it's still nice and cool. She doesn't like heat at all. But she is the best exercise companion I could ask for. Here we are. 638 and a half miles, half a mile, home to the finish with my other exercise partner, Daisy who sometimes loves to be on the run and other times just sits down by the side of the road and won't go anywhere. Today is a good day, we're moving though. Definitely my second favorite exercise partner. Daisy is a six year old black mouth cur and she is actually doing the dog version of the Great Virtual Race Across Tennessee. Um, it's been a little hot to do much of anything with her other than a little walking first thing in the morning or last thing at night, so she's only at like 111, 112 miles, but I'm going to try to get some more in. So this is it for this episode. Um, I will still be filming episodes as I try to hit a thousand miles, but I'm going to celebrate a little tonight and rest tomorrow. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. Daisy and I would appreciate it. <laughs>